Hello, my name is Carol, Carol Holland. I want to share my story with you about how I come to know Jesus. I grew up um, with my family, with my brothers, and I believed in Jesus and God, but I hadn't accepted him as my Saviour and Lord, looking back. I thought I was a Christian, I was christened, I was confirmed, and uh, I was... I. Th I thought I was right with the Lord, but I wasn't. Um, I wasn't an atheist. I believed in God, so therefore I was a Christian. But um, looking back now, um, I can see that I wasn't. So I continued. I loved go, liked to go to church. Made sure where I always went at Easter as I got older, and and Christmas Eve I had to be there, um, and the. Carols used to touch my heart, the, uh, the songs when we were singing, singing the songs about Jesus. But then I would just go back um, down the pubs and, and the clubs. Uh, so that, that really basically was how I continued my life. Well then, um, my uh, future husband, he became a Christian, he was seeking the Lord and he found him just before we got married uh, and we got married then in the January and I come to know Jesus in the February. We, It was difficult being married, uh, getting married and then w wanting different things. So Malvin used to want to go to church and I would uh, want to go to down the rugby club. So we were pulling different ways. So with the newness of marriage and... and then we wanted uh, the things differently. It was a bit of a struggle. But eventually I agreed to go to a meeting one evening and uh, the, 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 the preacher there, he was speaking about the joy of knowing Jesus. And I thought I need this joy because the church that I had been used to, it, you were afraid even to breathe properly in, in the church, but this time, the people were happy and they were clapping and it, it was so exciting and I responded that night to know Jesus and I accepted him as my saviour and my lord, realised that I was a sinner and that I needed Jesus in my life. And then a few months later then I decided to go through the waters of baptism, um, burying my old life and coming up in the newness of Jesus. Uh, since then, that was um, 37 years ago, um, I haven't looked back. It was the most joyous thing that I, that, that I could have done. He's, he's been with me through thick and thin, through um, sad times and happy times. And um, I just want to thank him that he's always been with me and he's always protected me. And... Um, we've got four lovely children, four girls, and we've got grandchildren, and, and the, the girls, and they all follow and know and serve the Lord. Um, and um, we're just so grateful and praying that our, the, our grandsons will grow up to know the Lord as well. Um, and I just um, pray now that this will speak and touch your hearts in the name of Jesus. God bless you. Amen.